How is developing software like cooking? Ingredients make a big difference. Let's learn how the Guac Project can help your software use secure ingredients. Afterwards, try the demo to see how you can get started in just a few minutes. When you make a tasty snack, you pay attention to the ingredients. You want to make sure they're fresh, that they're necessary for the recipe, and that they're safely produced. Imagine using rotten tomatoes or adding peas to your guacamole. Gross! Why not treat your software the same? Just like food poisoning can ruin your day, dealing with dependency problems can slow down your ability to develop software. There's a supply chain that gets your ingredients from the farm to your kitchen, and there's a supply chain that gets your dependencies to your development project. The software supply chain includes all of the people and tools that go into producing a piece of software. Every dependency that you pull in adds to your supply chain. To produce secure software, you have to consume secure software. But here's the problem. It's hard to get a full picture. You might have a software bill of materials, or SBOM, that lists the components that go into the software, but it doesn't tell you everything about those components. You need to know what vulnerabilities exist and if the developers follow secure practices. Guac can help. When you ingest your SBOMs into Guac, it collects information about unlisted dependencies, known vulnerabilities, OpenSSF scorecard, and more. Guac takes this data and builds a graph database so that you can see and explore relationships between all of the components in your software projects. If you're ready to make sure your software supply chain is secure, click the link below to explore the demos. If you need help or want to contribute, we'd love to have you join our community. Thanks for watching and happy snacking.